Hi guys, it's turning into a fine late afternoon finally here on this up till now gloomy Tuesday, February 27th, 2018. So I'm getting ready to post my uh, Voices from the Doomosphere interview with UT journalism professor Robert Jensen and uh, having the pleasure of listening to this interview I had on Saturday, which very well, I, I, you know, I don't mind saying this could be the, the single most intelligent uh, person that I've interviewed yet. Not to, I don't want to insult anyone else I've interviewed, but this is, a, you've, you have got to listen to this interview. But I just couldn't resist this, guys. I, I, just, I <laughs> I'm sorry. I just can't resist playing this 90 second clip uh, from this hour long interview uh, and I'm going to label this Hambone Little Tail's message to Guy McPherson. Uh, now obviously Guy McPherson's name was never mentioned in one hour in this intelligent interview but we did kind of rub up against him and so I'm going to let uh, Robert Jensen, uh, Professor Robert Jensen, speak for me. And would someone please send this message to Guy McPherson? Anybody, the bottom line for me is anybody who comes to me and says, listen, here's what's going to happen, here's the timeline on what's going to happen, and here's what you have to do about it, I'm likely to disregard because nobody has the capacity to predict. And it's ridiculous to impose on such a wide variety of people the same kinds of solutions. So you're, you're not at all in the, the, the near-term human extinction camp saying 10 years, we're gone. I think, is it a plausible claim that within a decade there will be a massive human die-off? Sure. But anybody who claims to be able to predict yeah. that, I think, is guilty of the same hubris, the same yeah. arrogance yeah. Yeah. that has led us to put chemicals in the environment that our tissues have no evolutionary history with <laughs> and are poisoning us. Right? Uh, I tend to be cautious and I tend to be very careful. And I don't know, it, that might be just a personality trait. I, <laughs> Anyway, guys, I just could not resist it, but that gives you a small taste of the uh, of this hour-long interview, which I will be posting shortly after I choose which quote to use as the title. Coming up at you in about 30 more minutes. Bye, guys.